Take a look at the picture. That's correct. Team two, your turn next. Take a look at the picture. Correct, one point. Team one, it's you to pick next. Take a look at the picture. That's correct. Team two, your turn next. Take a look at the picture. Correct, one point. Team one, it's you to pick next. Take a look at the picture. That's correct. Team two, your turn next. Take a look at the picture. That's correct for one point. Wow! <laughs> well done, everyone. Maximum points all round. Let's hope you can keep this going. Round two is called Guess the Year. I'll be showing you either a picture or a video clip and then asking you a Guess the Year question for two points. It's followed by two bonus questions for a point each. Team one, grab hold of the remote as you're going first. Look carefully at this picture. That's the correct year for two points. Well done. Well done. That's correct. Well done. One point. Well played. Maximum points there. Team two, the pressure's on you here. Let's see how you get on with your questions. 
Look carefully at this picture. That's the correct year for two points. Well done. Well done. That's correct. Well done. One point. Great TV knowledge there, Team 2. Well done. All three questions answered correctly means four points for you. That should improve your overall score nicely. Let's take a look. OK, teams, the next round is called On the Box. You'll both be shown a picture of a famous TV personality. Just tell me who they are for two points. You'll then get two more questions on that personality, worth a point each. Team one, here comes your picture. Look carefully at this picture. Well done. Two points for you there. Well done. That's correct. Well done. One point. Great telly knowledge there. Well done, Team 1. Four points to you. Team 2, the pressure's on you now. Here come your questions. Look carefully at this picture. Well done. Two points for you there. Well done. That's correct. Well done. One point. Great knowledge, Team 2. I'm impressed. Four points for your efforts there. That's the end of round three, so let's check the scores. Time for round four and a chance to get up to three points by guessing which one of the four people coming up is the odd one out. If you don't know straight away, you can ask for up to two clues. Each clue will take a point off your potential score, so think about how many points you want to play for. A wrong answer at any stage will mean you get no points at all. Team one, you should know by now that you're going first, so grab the remote. One of these people is the odd one out.
Crikey, very well done. Three points. Oh, that's going to be hard to beat. Team two, let's see what you can do. One of these people is the odd one out. Crikey, very well done. Three points. Those points will make a nice addition to your overall game score, Team 2. Well done, let's take a look. Round 5 and Classic Clips. The rules are pretty simple. Just watch the clip, then answer the questions that follow. Three points are up for grabs. Team one, as you've probably guessed, you go first and your clip is coming up first. Well done, that's the right answer for one point. Correct, well answered. Well done. That's the right answer. Well, that was clearly a favourite programme of yours, Team 1. Only maximum points will do here, Team 2. Good luck. Well done, that's the right answer for one point. Correct, well answered. Well done. That's the right answer. Wow! Don't know who's more surprised, you or me. Three out of three. Very well done. Let's see what that does to the scores. It's time for the sixth and the final round. Each of you will be faced with three general TV questions that you'll need to answer against the clock. Team one, your questions are coming up first. Don't take longer than 15 seconds to answer though.
That's right. That's right. Right. What a great way to finish team one. Well done. Three out of three for you. Team two, can you finish with maximum points? The first of your three questions against the clock is coming up now. That's right. That's right. Great stuff. Well done. Three out of three. What a way to finish. That's the end of round six and also the end of the game of Tele Addicts. Let's have a look at the final scores and see who is going to be crowned Tele Addicts champions. I don't believe it. After six rounds of ups and downs, you've managed to finish on the same number of points. That means we're into our tiebreak situation. Coming up is a question that you both need to select an answer to. The team whose answer is the closest to the correct one will be declared the winner. Team one, you get to choose your answer first, and here comes the question. Team one, your answer is correct. 